Imagine that you're driving, eyes on the road, both hands on the wheel, paying attention to your surroundings, pedestrians, other drivers. No problem, right? Now, imagine that you're driving whilst blindfolded. Seems completely unthinkable, doesn't it? Well, you're right, of course. But that is exactly what you're doing if you use your mobile phone to send a message or make calls whilst driving. You're no longer able to see what's around you, and it's incredibly dangerous. Writing a text message while driving makes you 23 times more likely to have an accident. Using your phone behind the wheel without a hands-free kit also carries with it great risk. The latest research shows that, in such cases, you are three times more likely to be involved in an accident. Why? Because everything which takes our attention off the road and from keeping both hands on the wheel is a distraction, which could prove very dangerous. It is not always possible to be completely free of distractions. But here are a few tips if you receive an urgent call whilst driving. Ask one of your passengers to answer the call or just let your phone ring out and let your voicemail pick up the message. If your device is equipped with a hands-free function, tell the person calling you that you will call them back when you're no longer driving. Stop as soon as possible in a safe place to call them back. If you're driving with children or animals that are distracting you, ask another passenger to help you. Make sure children are safely strapped into their car seats and that animals are in their appropriate carriers. This will stop them from moving around while you are driving and also protect them in the event of an accident. It is mandatory in many countries. If you are unable to do this, if your vehicle is not equipped with the appropriate child seats, stop off in a safe place and calm the children down. Paying attention to the road will allow you to be fully aware of your surroundings. Trucks and lorries which might not be able to see you. Cars driven by young motorists. Animals if you pass by a farm or a forest. Pay particular attention to the road users who are the most vulnerable. Pedestrians and two-wheelers. Imagine now that you are driving along at a certain speed and that you stop as quickly as possible within the car's braking limits. Did you see the braking distance? Now, let's double the speed at which you're driving. And once again, brake as quickly as possible. Will the braking distance be twice as long? Or what about three times as long? In fact, keeping all other conditions the same, the braking distance will be four times longer. The faster you drive, the longer the car will take to stop. Driving speed affects not only the car, but our brains too. When we drive fast, our brain has less time to process information and details of our surrounding environment. So, if a pedestrian or animal steps out into the road at the last minute, if a car in front breaks suddenly at distance which isn't safe, it is nearly impossible to avoid a collision. When we drive quickly, accidents are nearly always serious. In fact, research shows that a front impact accident at 50 miles per hour, even with the best technology in place, is nearly always fatal. To avoid such risks, never drive faster than the speed limits indicated on road signs, and make sure that you adjust your speed depending on the amount of road traffic present. To sum up, always maintain your full concentration on the road, don't drive too fast and respect other road users. Together, let's make the road a safer place for everyone.